Penguin problem separating. So 12 penguins were standing on the ice. Three of them dove into the water. How many penguins were left on the ice? Um, so here I have these keywords, 12 penguins, and three of them dove into the water. And it's asking us how many were left. So we are going to be subtracting. Um, so our equation, we have 12 standing on the ice. And then we're subtracting three of them because they dove into the water. So how many are left? We can use our picture um, also to help us, and we can use our number rack. I'm going to show you how to do both. Um, so let's move over 12 to start us off with, because we know we have 12 standing on the ice. That's 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. So we have 12, and we are subtracting 3. Um, so you can take them from the top or the bottom. I'm just going to take these three from the top. Um, and we had 12, so we can subtract 12, 11, 10, 9. Um, so our answer would be 9 here. Now I'm going to show you how you could use your pictures to help you. Um, so we have 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. And if we cross out these three that dove into the water, we could use our pictures to find the answer. Now let's count how many there are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. So that was our answer. Let's try another one. There were 14 penguins standing on the ice. Some of them dove into the water. Now there are only eight penguins left on the ice. So it's asking how many dove into the water. So it's telling us we have eight left. Um, so for our equation, we know we have our answer. There's eight left. We need to figure out our two add-ins. So we know there was 14 standing on the ice, and some of them dove into the water. So we don't know our middle part or our middle add-in. Um, so we need to figure that out. So let's show 14 on our number rack. I'm going to move over. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and four more. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen is um, our total, um, is what we started with standing on the ice, and then we subtracted some to get us to eight. Um, so let's count backwards from fourteen to see how many we can get to eight. Um, and I'm going to move our our beads on our number rack over. I'm going to put them on this side so we can see how many um, how many we subtracted. So here's 14. We need to get to eight. So there's 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8. So I stopped at eight because that's how I know um, that's how many were left. So let's figure out our middle part. How many are here? One, two, three, four, five, and six. So 14 minus six equals eight. Um, so let's check our answer. Does six plus eight equal 14? Because um, we know our fact families. Does six plus eight equal 14? Let's see. So let's show one, two, three, four, five, six, and we need to add eight, so there's six. We need to add eight more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So how many do we have here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So our answer is correct. Let's try one more. Some penguins were standing on the ice. Six of them dove into the water and started swimming around. Now there are only nine penguins left on the ice. How many penguins were on the ice to start? So let's count our penguins on the ice. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. So those nine were left on the ice. And um, some, some of these were standing on here, but six of them dove into the water. So our equation's going to look like this. We have an unknown, and we know six of those unknown dove into the water. And now 
there are only nine left. So here's what our equation looks like. We don't know where we started, how many were on the ice to start with. Um, so I'm going to show you two different ways we can use our number rack and our pictures here. Um, so our unknown number, and we subtracted six from that to equal nine. Um, so I'm going to show you how to do it with pictures. So here's our one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Um, so we had 15 to start with, right? That's a bad 15. Hold on one second. There we go. So we have 15. Um, on, we have 15 penguins shown on our on our problem here, and we know these six, one, two, three, four, five, six, dove in the water, and then now we are left with nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine.